hello guys welcome to my channel it's a girl diamond jack and in today's video we'll be talking about side effects of relaxer which is also known as chemical hair straightening products okay guys so i know it's been a long while i've been on this channel but if you have not subscribed to this channel please hit that subscribe button and remember to press the notification bell so that anytime i post you get to see my post so let's go into the main business all right chemical hair straightening products change the actual structure of our hair that's why you notice that when you start your hair you discover that your hair is a little bit darker and more headier but when you start using relaxer or chemicals that have this particular ingredients you just discover that your hair will start changing color from dark to brown from reddish from from brown to normal red to from from normal brown to reddish brown so these are what um these chemicals do to our hair this product often involve multiple processes and application to the scalp if you use straighteners or relaxer you may experience any number of uncomfortable potentially dangerous side effects additionally you are at risk of developing uterine endometry and ovarian cancer that's in women some of the potential dangerous side effects are we have lung damage reproductive disorder uterine fibroid badness early onset of menstrual cycles and breast development okay let's talk about this you know these days you discover that a child is at 10 and is menstruating or a child is at 9 and then the child has started developing breast back then it wasn't so but you know once we have our kids and then the kids are like two two years some is even at one year like a year will say okay they are relaxers in the market that they said they are kids relaxer and then we use it on the kids hair please do not use them on the kids hair because that those chemicals in there will cause so many effects to the child is going to enter through the bloodstream like you know your skin breath and your scalp is also your skin so that's why you see that children at nine are menstruating and we see that's normal thing and then you see children at seven eight start having breast developing breast is because of these chemicals we have them in different different things there are so many different chemicals somebody can say it's because of the climate change yes some is due to that but some is due to this relaxers and because we are having so many things that are affecting us so that is why we have to stop this chemical straightening product usage in our hair and then some of the dangerous side effects are burns sometimes when you relax your hair you discover that uh, the relaxer is too harsh on your scalp and then you discover that you have burns in there those are the things and then lesions you know now lesions are bruises it's still the same thing with burns you have scalp irritation you notice that some people don't even have dandruff but after applying certain relaxers they develop dandruff in their head these are signs of the irritation that you get from using relaxers and then some people might develop alopecia that is a loss of hair is those patches on your hair like some people have so many of you that have watched the new movie jennifer acted or funky akindele acted the name of the movie is she must be obeyed you discover that in the movie she had alopecia that was why she was always covering weak and not allowing other people to like so you get so just reduce the use of this chemicals that so guys let's go more into this let's elaborate on this dangerous side effects so we have numerous cancer which is also the side effect that severe complications due to formaldehyde alone can cause blindness that uh that that that, that ingredient in the core formaldehyde it can cause blindness that's if you continue using it and then you have lung irritation 
you when you're using relaxer there's some people that they start having long irritation and then some it might not be immediately but some is immediately you see then they have difficulty in breathing shortness of breath coughing and then swollen of long tissues so you have to watch on that and then you have nose and throat irritation some people when using re um, relaxers they have runny nose scratchy throat burning and itchy throat another one is allergies hmm this one there are so many there are so many things like some people is ordinary nuts they get allergic to it so you might say this one is nothing but then also uh, people have um allergies to the ingredients they use in making these products so and some of the allergies are stuffy or runny nose sneezing skin allergic reaction and asthma these are the allergies and then you have eye irritation that's why you notice that sometimes um when you're washing your hand the relaxer touches your eye or something you see redness watery eyes itchy and then bunny eyes then you have skin irritation as i use that when we are applying relaxer on your hair we we'll always cover your clothes so that it won't drop on your body and then instantly when it touches your ear it starts on um, reacting that's one of the skin irritation it start irritating your skin it start hurting your skin but you don't know that your scalp is also your skin you understand so just let's reduce the use of um uh, chemical hair straighteners okay let's talk about uterine cancer which is one among the cancers that are related to uh, relaxers so use of chemical hair straightening products which is also known as relaxer is associated with a higher risk of hormonal sensitive cancers including ovarian National Institute of Health, that's NIH, looked at nearly 34,000 women from 35 to 75 years of age in a research, and they identified 378 women who had developed uterine cancer. I know some of you will say out of um, 34,000, 378 is small okay it's over time so you don't know the ages that um they started using that the dev you don't know the edges they started using that they developed this particular cancer so don't say uh it's just a few out of that four thousand so let's go on women who frequently use this product were likely to develop uterine cancer than women who had never used a chemical relaxer you will say some people have not used before but they have um uterine cancer as i earlier said this um ingredients they are using so many other products it's not just a relaxer so it's not something that you say okay so this person have never relaxed the person's hair but was having uterine cancer or something so uh don't think about uh just relax I alone but when i'm listing the ingredients please ensure to check them in any product you are using on your body okay black women and uterine cancer and in nih study 60 percent of the black women are reported using uh, chemical straighteners okay the effect may be greater for black women because they are more likely to use this product you know we the blacks we are the ones using these um chemical straightening products more because we don't like our hair coily we don't like the afro we say it's too painful and all that so we just have to relax it so that it will be easier to comb and all that so we tend to use this particular product to make our hair less painful but i'm telling you i'm a natural hair so i use water leave-in conditioner to comb my hair and it's quite easy it's not painful you can use your hand to detangle instead of just combing all through and then using heat to do that or using relaxer you can just keep a natural hair not only do black women report using chemical hair straighteners more frequently but they also tend to start using this product at early 
ages yeah it's true some of us when we were in secondary school um yeah i started making my hair in secondary school and then i had to cut and start again so in secondary school i was using relaxer so i started using relaxer at an earlier stage like nine so just imagine from nine to this level i was using relaxer and the chemical is growing and mean and all that and then it's mixing with my blood and then working in my system so that's what used to cause on all this okay because of the frequency use black women at higher risks for uterine cancer compared to women who did not report using this product the study find out that why hair straighteners did put you at risk of developing uterine cancer other hair products did not this include bleach and hair dyes i felt hair dyes too because hair dyes contain some of the hair dyes contains um hydrogen peroxide and hydrogen peroxide is not good too but okay there are some hair dyes that doesn't use um hydrogen peroxide it's not all so the major ingredients in the chemical hair relaxers are the damage of chemical hair straightening products lies with the chemicals themselves these harmful ingredients are formaldehyde this chemical is dangerous in and of itself mm. it poses over more risks to saloon workers who inhale the fumes for long periods of time long-term exposure may increase your risk of developing cancer so you see as a saloon person or a saloon worker anytime you're in the saloon and you're supposed to relax somebody's hair if, we, if it's very very important that you have to do that please make sure you use nose marks and then you use hand gloves to cover your hands cover your hands to protect them so that those chemicals will not enter your hands because this formaldehyde formaldehyde can enter your hands that's oh to enter your hands and then your eyes and it causes cancer then you have sodium sodium hydroxide also commonly known as lye which breaks the di disulfide bonds in your hair High concentration can lead to bones and temporary hair loss as well as skin, eye and lung irritation. As I earlier said, some of these relaxers, they burn your hair so badly. That means it's because of the sodium hydroxide is much in it. So watch out when you're buying them. Okay, you have um, parabens. Parabens, are, most of them are, um, are preservatives. So they are found in almost all products. So you should check and ask, verify before you use. All parabens used for commercial purposes are endocrine dis disrupting chemicals. Often multiple chemicals are used in just one product. Yeah, it's true. Common parabens include methyl parabene, propyl parabene, and then betyl parabene. Then we have encyclopedia. Cyclosilicans. Cyclosilicans are used in multi component hair relaxer kits. Exposure to these chemicals can injure skin and harm your reproductive system. I hope you're getting it. Trichosam may disrupt your endocrine system. You can absorb this substance through the skin. So watch out for trichosam too. Other includes hydrogen peroxide, as I earlier said ammonia hydroxide isopropyl alcohol boric acid and bromides okay guys i hope this video was informative so if you watch and you love this video please give it a thumbs up drop a comment in the comment section and then please remember to follow this channel and press the notification bell so anytime i post you get to see it all right guys bye see you in my next video